Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to make this very easy unisex sort of a waffle stitch hat and scarf set and also a cowl. So let's get started. I post videos on Tuesdays and Fridays and sometimes a bonus in between. Please subscribe and click the notification bell. You can slow down the videos by clicking the gear icon below the video. I'm going to show you how to crochet this easy stitch. It can be used to make sweaters or blankets or anything that you would like to crochet, really. But today I'm going to show you how to make a scarf. And I'm also going to show you how to make a hat out of this stitch. And this is how it looks on one side. And here's how it looks on the other side. So it looks good either way. So I'm going to get started. I'm working with worsted weight yarn and a 6 millimeter crochet hook. First I'll show you how to make the scarf. Start with a slip knot. Double crochet in a third stitch from the hook. One, two, three. To make a double crochet yarn around the hook, insert into the stitch, pick up the yarn and pull it through, pick up the yarn, pull it through two loops, pick up the yarn and pull it through the remaining two loops. And you're going to go ahead and double crochet in each stitch all the way across your foundation chain. Like that, all the way across the chain. Okay, I made a double crochet in each stitch all the way across the chain. At the end of the row, chain two and turn. Work a front post double crochet in this next stitch. This is the post of the double crochet. So yarn around the hook, pass your hook under the post of the next stitch, pick up the yarn, pull it through, pick up the yarn, pull it through two, pick up the yarn, pull it through two. In the next stitch, make a regular double crochet. In the next stitch, make a front post double crochet. In the next stitch, make a double crochet. Like that, and you're going to repeat that all the way across the row. So front post double crochet. and a double crochet. All the way across the row. Okay, I worked all the way across the row. I have two stitches left. That was a front post double crochet. So I'm going to make a double crochet in this stitch. And my last stitch is that turning chain. And I'm going to make a front post double crochet in that last stitch like that chain two and turn double crochet in each stitch all the way across the row a regular double crochet in each stitch all the way across the row. And you'll repeat the row of front post double crochet and a regular double crochet. And this is a two row repeat. So you're simply going to repeat those two rows like that. Just keep repeating those two rows until the scarf is as long as you would like it. For a long scarf, that would be about 72 inches long. To make a hat, you're simply going to make another section exactly the same as making a scarf, 
and you'll make it to be 22 to 24 inches long. And then you're just going to fold it. So you're going to bring your foundation row and the last row worked together. And I'm going to slip stitch to join. So I insert my hook on this side and in the stitch. And pull that stitch through. And now you're going to match the stitches and you'll insert through this side and through the other side. So on this side there's only one loop because it's the foundation row and on this side it's the top of the double crochet. So pass through the one loop on this side and two on the other side and slip stitch to join. So you just go from one stitch to the next stitch and you're going to slip stitch all the way down through one stitch on this side and the other stitch on the other side. Like that. And you're going to do that all the way down. Okay, I've gone ahead and I have joined all the way down. So now I have a tube. And if you want to make a cowl, this is exactly how you would make a cowl. So I have this tube, which could be used as a cowl. And to finish this into a hat, I'm now going to slip stitch across this open end to form the top of the hat. Okay, so there's where I finished slip stitching to join. And here's the opening of the tube. So I'm going to skip about four stitches. One, two, three, four. It doesn't have to be exact. So just any length, about an inch, an inch and a quarter. I'm going to slip stitch. And then I'm going to do the same thing all the way around. Slip stitch. Slip stitch. Slip stitch. Slip stitch. And you can see that's gathering up the top of the hat. So I'm going to do that all the way around. Okay, so I've worked one row of slip stitching and I'm just going to keep doing that until the top of the hat is closed. So skip about three or four stitches and slip stitch. And it's almost closed. I only have a small amount left. So And one more probably across here and fasten off and you'll have closed the top of the hat like that. And there's the finished hat. And if you like you can add a pom-pom and I'll put a link below on how to make these easy faux fur pom-poms. And there you go. That's how easy it is to crochet this unisex scarf and hat set or even a cowl. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.